from the Ivy League today, tomorrow night's game. How, what form are the boys in? Are they looking good for tomorrow? Yeah, today is the last day before the match. We will prepare the, with the squad tomorrow we will start. And, and yeah, tomorrow will be an interesting game. And we'll see the have a good team with the squad. And uh, they play at home. And also, the way that they play, they want to play the ball, they want to play good football. Also, us think that uh, you can play more free. And I think that tomorrow will be a game that the people can enjoy and for sure that they are both. David Peter's last game, obviously they're going to be trying to get a win for him to send him off on a high. How much does that impact your playing style? No, uh, our, our playing style will be the same. We have our own style and need to try to keep. And uh, of course, you change small things depending on the team that you play. Uh, thinking in tactics, maybe one movement, another movement. You arrange things like this, but in the end, the, the essence, the, the philosophy is there. What we want to do is, is our style, our way, keep the ball, attacking football. But uh, depending on every team, you change a little bit the movement, but not a big change. Sergio, are you, are you happy to take on Dante? Looking forward to the challenge? Yeah, I'm happy to, to play against him because uh, last year uh, he's been a very important player for, for the national team in Spain and I'm looking forward to playing against him. And will be, I'm very excited to, to do it. Have you got any Spanish sledge for him? Sorry? Have you got any Spanish words for him? Any sledge? I don't know, maybe yeah, I want to change with him the the t shirt and but I think everybody wants to change so maybe <laughs> with the language I have a little bit of advantage. <laughs> no change we all got more, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I asked Milan. Like, you, you need to do that they bring to you, but you don't bring to the no, next okay. game you can play. I have to ask Milan. Like. <laughs> <laughs> well, how much of a challenge do you see him as? Like, you see him as a, you know, a big figure. How much of a challenge coming up against someone like that who has achieved so much? What, you know, what does that do to you? Is that a massive challenge? Can you repeat, please? Is, is it a massive challenge coming up against David? Yes, it will be a, a big challenge. Um, but no, just because of him, um, also, they have another big players, uh, a very good players, and I think it will be a, a very equal game because both teams we want to keep the ball, and I think the team that keep more the ball will have more more chances to to win the game. Sergio, David Villa scores goals, but you yourself have been very good for him. How are you feeling going into this game? Yeah, I feel good very good, but also the whole team is doing very well. I think that we improved from last season. Uh, at home, we are very strong. And the, the aim that we put for this season is to improve away. And I think we start very well winning in, in Brisbane. And we have to keep doing this and, and try to get the three points against Meru. So, Sergio, is there a reason why you found yourself in goal scoring opportunities a lot more earlier this season than last season? I don't know. Uh, I think that I, I'm, I'm having the same changes as that last season, but maybe I, I improved from last season the percentage to, for the scoring, and I hope to, to keep doing this. Uh, but if I cannot score, I can also help the team passing or working, and that is the, the most important for me. Joseph, will Bruce come back for this game? Yeah, Bruce is uh, already uh, okay for tomorrow. And for us, uh, a big, <laughs> a, a big uh, improvement because he's an important player for, for us. And he's ready and he will play. Sergio, how good is that partnership between yourself and Bruce Jutta? Um, yeah, very good, but I think Bruce 
is doing a, a very good job, not just scoring. Uh, they, uh, he does a, a job that is very important for the team because almost every time he receives the ball uh, with a center back pressing him. And for the team is very important because when we are under pressure, he keeps the ball, uh, control the ball and make the pass. And that is a, a very important job for us. Just that, were you expecting uh, City to be very aggressive tomorrow, given that they haven't won a game this season? Hungry? Of course, they will be hungry for sure, uh, because uh, they need to win every single game that they play. Last game from the Liga, that also for sure that he wants to leave Australia winning a game in front of his fans. For sure that will be a game that they will put all the efforts for to try to win. But uh, this is enough, every single game. Eh? Every single team wants to win, every single team wants to have this, uh, this strong way for to try to win these games. And, and also as we go there, thinking to, to bring points to other like and, and, and to win this game also. Joseph, you've had time to think about your performance against Perth. How good was it in your opinion? What grade would you give it? Yeah, I think that, that we are doing well. Uh, we did a good game. Uh, I think that we play good football, satisfied with, with the players. But uh, this happened on Sunday. Now we need to keep this, this Friday. Uh, there are some mistakes also that we try to arrange. We show today in the video to the players. Every single game is different. What is important is that they keep this mentality, that uh, they play every single game, uh, concentrate and 120% uh, uh, from his performance in terms of physically pressing, because in the end, uh, skills and uh, the way that we play, we know uh, we are doing well, but also it's important this, no? every single moment that uh, the ball is not with us, uh, is important and we need to try to recover the ball as soon as possible. Uh, if Bruce comes back in, then do you change shape? Do you change the shape at the back goes at three again? Or no, the depending, depending. Now we have also a player that is 50-50 uh, to play tomorrow, and depending what happens, we will do. We can play with four, we can play with three, depending. depending. Uh, but uh, then Bruce is the striker, and the striker is, is in with 4-3-3 and with 3-4-3. Uh, it's not a player that can change the way that we play. Who is in doubt? We have Pablo now, that is we need to try today. We can, we can be in the league or not. Um, A1 Mobile has drawn interest from Europe. Will you allow him to go over and train in January? Look, for us, uh, we are a club that uh, we want to help our players to, to grow and, and to develop. Uh, in this moment, uh, we have uh, some clubs that ask for possibilities, uh, but what we want is that if really a club is interested in him, not just that a club that uh, asks for a trial, because in the end we are playing the league, we are in competition, and to go to a trial is something that uh, that uh, we in the club we don't think that is the best. Uh, the best thing is when a club really show interest for him, and in that moment we will have the player, and we will bring uh, all the facilities for, for to develop him. For us, it's an aim to play good football, but also if we can create players and help players to grow and to go to an important league. It's also something that for us is uh, very important. But uh, doing the right things, uh, now we are in October, not in January. There are two months in front, and it's important that I will be important with us playing and showing that he's a good player. If not, no reason for to go to Europe to make a trial if he, if he is not doing well here. Was that miss, the worst you've seen? Last week, I always miss. Uh, no, no. You, this can happen. You can miss a goal, but no, no, no. In football, there are more important things than miss a goal or score a goal. Uh, is the position, you know, the, the way that you play, tactically, miss a goal or score a goal is not. Uh, it's not something that I, I am concentrated in this. He scored, he missed. It doesn't matter. And for me, the important is that when he have the ball, he do the right things. When he don't have the ball, he do the right things. In the end, what the, the coaches are looking for, not just the goals, the, the coach. When you sign a player, you don't see, don't sign a player because he scored a goal or he missed a goal. You sign a player because he has something that can improve your team.